vinyl community. Um, <laughs> uh, it's raining like hell here. Um, I've gotten a couple of comments and a phone call from Bobby Z asking me how I'm doing. Um, I'm lucky, um, but I don't know how long it's going to last. Um, the water is getting bad, uh, really bad here. So, just to show you, this is what it was like when the hurricane first hit. So, what I'm showing you here is uh, kind of the water retention pond that, that's just down the street from me. And there's also a drainage area, uh, like I'm showing you here, that, that is almost to uh, its max capacity. And that was yesterday. But last night it was even worse, so it really started raining hard at 11 o'clock, and it just, it was worse than when the hurricane first landed. We were just getting pummeled. And the, the thunderstorms here on the Gulf, uh, when they're really bad, it's like nonstop lightning, nonstop thunder. So um, I don't think I even got to sleep till about 2 o'clock, and I woke up at 6, and this is kind of what I saw. So, it's hard to make out from the grainy video, but there's like a lake that's developing here. And uh, so, my neighbor across the street is really, really stupid. So, here he has a Dodge pickup truck on a lift kit. And he also has a Mercedes. Uh, it's one of the higher end models. I don't remember what, what it is, but uh, it's an $80,000 car. And he parks it more towards the road, which turns into a river. And take a look at this. This is just amazing. So yeah, it, <laughs> can't you put your truck on a lift kit and in place of where the Mercedes is? I, I don't know. It, uh, yeah, it's it's amazing. So uh, it's predicted to get worse. Uh, I haven't had any water intrusions in my house yet, but we're expected to get more rain. So I'm really concerned if we get another tight cell um, that yeah, I will have water intrusion into my house. Uh, so what I've done is I've moved things upstairs. So I got my speakers here. Uh, just to show you, I've moved some vinyl. <laughs> uh, yeah, here's all my equipment. Yeah. So, people wondered what the rest of the room looks like. Now you know. And uh, so, uh, let me give you a shot downstairs. So, here's uh, where I typically keep a, a part of my vinyl. So, I've moved all the vinyl from the Ikeas down below, and I've kind of moved them up. Of course, uh, Billy bookcases make nice CD shelves. Uh, I've moved the first two rows up, uh, just anticipating some water intrusion in the home. Uh, a lot of our furniture and other things we've moved upstairs. And then, of course, this treadmill, of course, is something that I can't easily move. But uh, because of the room setup, and this is one of the reasons I haven't done a room tour, I don't like the idea of a treadmill but now folks have an idea of what one of the music areas is like uh, outside of my turntable which you see frequently on films so hopefully I won't get any water intrusion in here but I'm preparing for the worst so uh, yeah I, I appreciate the the well wishes um, I just hope that uh, uh, things are gonna lighten up a little bit and it's not gonna be as bad as forecasted but uh, I'm a little bit thankful because I, I've had employees that have had water intrusion in their home. Um, of 
course, folks know that I work at NASA, and so we got folks at NASA uh, manning the consoles to watch the space station. And uh, yeah, they're not going to get any relief here at the moment. So yeah, they've they've closed the center down, preventing people, new people, from coming in because they don't want people going on the road. So uh, I am thankful. I don't have it as bad as other people do, but uh, it could get a lot worse. So uh, thank you for staying tuned. Uh, Hopefully I will be back with another video, but I don't know when.